Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. We have two special guests for today's Starbucks video, you guys. Just the more the merrier around here. Literally. Wow. The merrier. Mm -hmm. It's the holiday season. And today we're going to be trying Starbucks holiday menu and your guys' favorite Starbucks holiday drinks. I could just try the regular Starbucks holiday menu, chestnut praline latte, caramel brulee latte, mm -hmm. but Where's the flavor? Where is the flavor? We. Great question. <laughs> <laughs> I always tell you guys the best Starbucks drinks are the ones with a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Sprinkle with that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Top it with a little something extra. So I asked you guys on my Instagram for your guys' favorite drinks, and you guys came in hot, just like always. It was a lot. Mm hmm. It was overwhelming. <laughs> like, I might just do a part two of this video. You should. So let me know if you guys want that. Because honestly, I, I can with the amount of drink recommendations you guys came at me with. It was overwhelming. So that's what we're gonna be doing. And yeah, let's just let's just get right into it. I'm gonna do the same thing I did in my last video, go through once and then go through again. So these drinks are fresh and ready for us to try. And we got treats today. Oh! I can't wait to just drink some coffee. Bella hasn't had any coffee today. All day, it's 3.11. I've really been torturing her. You know, I just needed you to try these drinks to their full potential. I was planning on it. Yeah. Full so potential. you are caffeine starved. No caffeine until this moment right now. Mm-hmm. We're going for it. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I'm very excited. <laughs> Look at this. Bobby. One of your videos I literally screenshot and he's in this exact same position. <laughs> he knows his angles. He knows his angles. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Starbucks. How are you doing today? I'm doing good, how are you? I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. What can I get started for you today, though? And then you said the snowman one, right? Yeah. Beautiful. That can be your total to 32.45, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you. I am so sorry. There was, first of all, so much that I need to say about that. Number one, her energy unmatched. It was like, it was Christmas Eve, mm -hmm. and she was like, I'm going for mm -hmm. it. I'm giving you all of my holly jolly environment mm -hmm. energy. Second thing, when did Starbucks become so like tech savvy with this, you can see your order <laughs> as it's coming up like beautifully too. It's like perfectly organized as you're saying it, it's showing up. That was probably one of the best Starbucks experiences I've ever had. Mm -hmm. Ever. I should be playing in the winter snow. Um, I don't want to miss I out on you a holiday, want to no? but I can't stop right. staring at your face. All right, bud. You shot it with you. Thank you. Oh, she knew. No, he's he's a regular here. He's a regular. Bodhi, come here. Thumbnail. These all look so good. Delicious. That first one, this one, does it look up your alley? It's really looking fabulous because it's not looking too milky like these mm -hmm. are. Okay, what are we going to start with? Let's start with the one, that one. This one? I, I don't know. Let's go for it. I, yeah. <laughs> okay, it's a grande iced caramel brulee with mm -hmm. two pumps toffee nut syrup, two pumps caramel brulee sauce, no whip, and sub for oat milk. Mm -hmm. I am a big fan of caramel brulee lattes. These have been my favorite for years now. She's never, never had, had it. Had it. You've never I've, had. This I've Starbucks never really gone for holiday. the whole Starbucks holiday environment. So this is I'm a really boring. big day for you. Yeah, you can try it first because I'm a little anxious about it. I am so ready. Why am I nervous? <laughs> okay. It smells amazing. Does it? Do we love her? Give me all the senses. I want all five. Taste, sight, hearing. <laughs> Ooh, it's all a 10 out of 10. All 10 out of 10? All of the above, 10 out of 10. <gasps> I've never had the holiday menu with oat milk before though. Oh, that's so fun. So that is amazing because it's got the flavor, but it's not still, too much. It's, it's not too much and there's still coffee mm -hmm. and it's creamy mm -hmm. and it's great. Okay, your turn. <sighs> oh my God, wow. What even is that flavor? It almost, 
and correct me if I'm wrong, it almost has like a chocolate yes, taste just to it. Yes, I was just thinking. But, but I don't know where it's coming from. I don't know. I don't either. Maybe it's a mix. But like, I'm honestly confused by this because what's in it is not what I'm getting out of it. Exactly. The toffee nut is usually the one that like sticks out in front of all the other syrups. But here, it just blends together so nicely. So good. It's so good. Uh -huh. That is amazing. I mean, I love the Crown Brewer Latte, but with the toffee nut, I so think good. I think it just made this drink mm -hmm. even better. That is the best Crown Brewer Latte I've had. Really? I think I just stuttered. This one is so Bella Speed, so we really just have to take it there. It's a triple blonde espresso. Ristretto. I don't know. I don't know. If you understand, you can make sense of it. Iced triple blonde ristretto with four pumps, chestnut praline, and oat milk. That's what she is. So you go for it. Go for it. What are we feeling? I love it. Really? But I'm confused by it. Oh, maybe that's why, because I've never had chestnut praline. Okay, so, so it's the flavor is just new to me. But the coffee itself, I'm not mad at this at all. I, I'm giving this an 8.9 out of 10. Oh. Mm hmm. Right? It's confusing. You're kind of like, what's happening there? No. I feel like the coffee's a little burnt. It tastes burnt. Yes. <laughs> it does taste yes, burnt. Yes, it tastes burnt. But it's also like, really sweet exactly i'm very confused i was really excited for that one yeah it's too sweet when i thought it was gonna be very coffee me too and like perfect how many for pumps? us i feel Four. like it needs two yeah maybe go for two you can go for two let's let's move on we'll work on something else let's go with this one because apparently this has been all over tiktok and i haven't seen it really? but so many people recommended this one and i kept seeing it over and over again and i didn't know why because i never really heard of this combo before and then someone said that they saw it on tiktok so i'm guessing someone over there is doing some magic good for them basically it is a grande iced chestnut praline latte with two pumps of chestnut praline syrup so it's half sweet one pump of chai and oat milk with no whipped cream chai 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 and let me just say i thought Everyone was for like the Crown Brulee lattes, but everyone is for chestnut praline. Everyone like, for they go all of them are chestnut praline. For chestnut praline. Mm -hmm. This goes out to all of the chestnut praline lovers. Okay. You're looking suspicious. Yeah, because it doesn't taste like much. No. Mm mm. I'm confused. It just tastes like milk and there's coffee in there. It tastes like watered down. It tastes like almost dirty water. I don't taste the coffee at all. No, me either. I'd say if you're gonna get this, get it with blonde espresso so maybe you can taste the coffee more and then get like three pumps of chestnut praline. Yeah, or get an extra shot. That might be fun. That could be inviting. That could mm -hmm. start your day off mm -hmm. like you wouldn't believe. I think the pump of chai, I don't think it's necessary. If you want that like little cinnamon taste, get cinnamon dolce. Guys! Look at her coming in with the substitutions, mm -hmm. guys. This is why you come back. <laughs> this is why you continue to come back for this reason. Let's see if this one's better because this one is, it's pretty similar. This is a chestnut praline latte with toasted white mocha, half sweet. So it's only two pumps of chestnut praline, two pumps of toasted white mocha, and with oat milk. I've never had toasted white mocha. And no whip. Toasted white mocha is really good. I think it is better than regular white mocha. Really? I'm gonna say it. Okay, I'm nervous. I don't know about this chestnut praline life. <laughs> chestnut praline life is not for us. Really? Are we, did we only have one drink that we liked? This is embarrassing. I'm embarrassed. No, it's good. It's good. I'm just so confused by chest and praline. I Me don't. Too. I'm so confused. I don't by understand. It. If someone wants to like leave a comment on what chestnut praline is, maybe it's like cilantro with the required gene, and you just don't have. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm like here for it, but it's not my favorite. This is another one I'm not getting much out of it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm not actually mad at this one. I think this is like might be the second best. I think so too. I think it's good. I don't think I like Trust on Pretty Lane. I don't think I'm a fan. I think it is too sweet. Definitely. Oh my gosh, look at these bags. <gasps> look how cute. This one is, I look forward to this holiday season. I need this in my life. This is a sugar plum danish. Is it literally plum? Oh, Bodie. <gasps> oh my gosh, Bella. Oh <laughs> my God, I'm overwhelmed. Ready? Uh, are we gonna do it at the same time? Cheers, Cheers. Bella. Oh my God, we're <laughs> <our> friends. <laughs> I'm getting croissant vibes. Mm-hmm. From her. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Yes! I love that we're all feasting together. <laughs> wow. I mean, this is like a sweet treat. Look at the layers. Are you kidding me? Wow. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm. That is the sweetest thing I've ever seen. This is what you look like, buddy. <laughs> that is full holiday spirit. What do you do, just bite it? Yeah, it's a cake pop. Have you never had a cake pop before? No, I've never actually. <laughs> <laughs> These are life changing. Are they? What's, um. It's better than regular cake. I don't like regular cake. These are moist and delicious. What, what is this cake inside? <laughs> what vanilla cake? Maybe it's the white chocolate. Ooh. Wow, that was fun. That's something, you know, you get your kids, or not, or you. It's a little sweet treat. It it's is a little sweet treat. It's perfect size. And it's so easy to eat. Mm-hmm. Wow. That was crazy. Are you ready for four more drinks? I'm more than ready. I need to get the caffeine rolling. Next Starbucks, here we come. Four new beverages. Here we go. Round two. Ooh, Bella's ready. Are you oh, ready? Oh, I'm so ready. Can I put this on the floor? Do you hear? Yeah, go okay. ahead. Can we start with a matcha? Because I just feel like I need up. a matcha. Sure. Here we got a matcha latte mm -hmm. with sweet cream cold foam and peppermint. 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 You know, I love I a matcha, start. so I need a matcha with a holiday twist on it. You know? Mm -hmm. Let's go for it. For you. Do we love her? That's not bad. Really? No, it's not bad at all. It's giving me Grinch vibes. Mmm. Are you okay? I just love this foam I've so much. I've never um, really had Starbucks matcha. Like, I've had no. like sips of it, but. She's sweeter than usual. Mm -hmm. I know. Wait, this is so good. <gasps> Ooh, whoever, they know what they're doing. They know what they are doing. Good for them. That is good. That was good. This is like an afternoon holiday drink. Afternoon holiday drink. You know, because I like to have my matcha like around this time, three to like five o'clock. Mm -hmm. Little afternoon pick me up, mm -hmm. but make it Christmas. Make it Christmas. Holly jolly. The foam, crazy. The foam makes it that much better. That much better. It really does. Let's go for a hot beverage because you want that? this, I mean, the cups, you guys. Okay. okay, this one I am very intrigued by because a lot of people also recommended an eggnog latte. I don't remember their eggnog latte like standing out to me at all. This is a chai tea latte made with eggnog. So any of the drinks, I think on like the Starbucks menu, instead of milk, you can have them make it with eggnog, I believe. Don't take my word for that, but that's what I saw on the Starbucks app. Like another milk substitute? Yes. Oh my God, look at Starbucks go. I know, and I think this is like a thing because I saw a bunch of people also on Twitter say that they get their eggnog with chai. I don't know. 
I don't know. That's unique. I'm actually really excited for this because I'm kind of in the mood for like a hot drink. I kind of right like now. that too. Yeah. I feel like snuggling up with a blanket, mm -hmm. watching Elf. <gasps> Why do you do things like that all the time? And possibly drinking this drink if it's good. So let's see. This is exciting. Really? She went for a second sip, guys. Really? Is she an That's acquired taste? That's quite nice. Really? That's quite nice. I don't think you're gonna <laughs> like it. <laughs> I'm nervous. Cause you're a coffee girl. There's no coffee in this. Yeah, I'm nervous. Oh, it's not as bad as I was expecting it to be. Wait a minute. Quite nice. Wait, wait a minute. The taste is better than the smell. Oh yeah, oh the yeah, taste definitely. Is better. It doesn't taste how it smells. A lot it of things. It doesn't taste how it smells. Taste how they smell. Sometimes this the doesn't. five senses really, really mess with mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. But this, wow, it's good. Mm -hmm. It's good. The chai makes it like cinnamony. Yes, and that's mm -hmm. good. Great thinking because I wouldn't think to make any of the Starbucks drinks with eggnog, okay. but you're switching it up. You, you got are. bright ideas, and I like that. This one was supposed to be cold and it was supposed to be with vanilla sweet cream foam. So I don't know how they made this. Just says a toasted wet mocha with peppermint syrup. It was supposed to be iced with sweet cream cold foam. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my drink? Guys. Yo, know, she basically was like, this is too overwhelming. I'm not doing it. I'm kind of scared to try it because I don't know. It just is, a, it's a toast white mocha with peppermint. Yeah, I feel like it can't be bad. <laughs> Maybe the barista just surprised us. Maybe she was like, don't get it like that, get it like this. Yeah. Because this is good. Really? Mm-hmm. Love that. Mmm. Really? That is good. Does it have any milk substitute or is no, it No, it doesn't. Milk? It's regular milk. But if you got it with oat milk, probably just as good. Yeah, I like this. Mm. I like this. It's subtle. Mm -hmm. Not as sweet as I was expecting. Usually the toasted white mochas are pretty sweet, pretty but sweet. I think that's when they're iced. A lot of the drinks, when they're hot, they don't taste they as taste sweet. Like yes. So it's good. I'm not mad at this at all. This one's good. I do wish that it had like oat milk or something. Me too. Some type of milk substitute would be great. Mm -hmm. Okay, Bodhi's here for our last beverage. Did you order it? <laughs> What's happening? What is happening? This is literally just an iced latte with oat milk. No. And we're back. Here is the last drink. We did so much to get here to this point. We did. I went back in and got the correct drink this time. So basically, I'm pretty excited for this one because this is like my OG favorite drink that I recommend to anyone. You guys know I love a two pumps toffee nut, two pumps white mocha. This right here is a latte, two pumps toffee nut, two pumps toasted white mocha with oat milk. To bring the holly jolly vibes. Yeah, mm -hmm. gotta bring in some type of holly jolly in here. This is just like obviously the holiday twist on the classic, you know what I mean? Which you love. Which I live and breathe for, so let's see. Is it good? She do it well? Bodhi's like, I want in on the action. I wish Bodhi could drink coffee. Can dogs drink coffee? I don't I, think. That's good for them. Doubt it. Mike, if I had a dog, it'd be coffee in the water That's thing. why you don't have a dog. <laughs> Do you get the toasted white mocha vibe? Oh yeah. Okay, good. It's definitely different than the regular one. Oh, it's so good. Is it? I think the toasted white mocha is just amazing. You have to admit, toffee nut is the best syrup at Starbucks. It is. It is. Like our two favorite drinks have toffee nut in it. I think it's the best syrup to go with coffee. It just like complements it so well. I know. I know. I think this is giving me a hot flash. Like this one is so good. <laughs> we got some winners here. Oh my God. Wow. This put cheers. Cheers to toffee nut. Mm -hmm. Cheers to the holiday season people. 
We're here. We're in the midst. We're we. That was a big. That was a big word. <laughs> This has really put me in the mood for Christmas and everything, for me Thanksgiving, too. all mm -hmm. of it. I really needed this. Me too. Thank you guys so much for coming along with us today. We had such a great time trying all of your guys' holiday drinks. I most likely will be doing a part two to this video because there were so many other drinks that we did not try. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for coming along with us to try these drinks. As always, let me know if you try any of them. Tag me on Instagram. Let me know what you guys think. Comment down below which ones you are interested in trying or leave more holiday drinks down below for the next video for part two. Subscribe if you have not already. Like today's video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.